this is potentially going to be a huge day for Market Basket. It's been one week since the store employees walked off the job, leaving food sitting at the warehouse. Store shelves are empty. This morning, workers are planning a huge rally outside the Market Basket in Tewksbury, Massachusetts, as they continue to demand that former CEO Arthur T. DeMoulis be reinstated. Ray Brewer joins us live this morning in Tewksbury with the details of today's protest. Good morning, Ray. Good morning, Sean. Employees are calling today's protest the grand finale. Now it'll happen the same time that the board is meeting in Boston uh, at the Prudential Center. Now the rally is set to begin at 9 this morning. The employees hoping this protest will convince company leaders to reinstate former CEO Arthur T. DeMoulis. Now his cousin Arthur S. fired him in June. Arthur T. says he is trying to buy out the 50.5% of the company that is owned by Arthur S. and his supporters. While I'm not saying how much he is offering, Arthur T. did call it a very full and fair deal, and experts have valued the total company as worth between three to three and a half billion dollars. Now, Market Basket employees say all they want is to have their former leader back on the job. He was really great to us as um, employees and also to the customers, bringing about the four percent off and um, just like giving back to the customers and everything. So we're just trying to return it to the way it was. I feel like it's the right thing to do. I support this man 110 percent as he supported all of us. Now, if the company doesn't resolve this family feud soon, well, you've already seen the store shelves are empty and the company could soon begin to lose its loyal customers. Reporting live in Tewksbury, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.